Clearly to me the secret to fighting Ebola is education. Um, the, uh, while I was in Kono we had um, the sad case of a, one illegal burial of a taxi driver in a community and from that one illegal burial we had 28 confirmed cases of Ebola. You fight Ebola with um, public health actions. So making sure that people are aware and knowledgeable about stopping the transmission routes for Ebola, making sure that patients are promptly identified and contained to stop the transmission. Education and knowledge is a, is a good thing, uh, it's, but it's more complicated than that. You need a, the infrastructure to support it around ambulances to respond to people who are sick, the, the dead body teams. Red Cross in Liberia were doing all of the um, safe and dignified burials in Monrovia and they had 15 teams working um, day after day to, to do this. And then you need the, the, the treatment centres for people to go to. So now that there are resources there, whether it be the Red Cross or MSF or other government agencies, it's, you can respond a lot quicker now to new outbreaks of Ebola in remote areas than you could have six months ago.